Today, we're making a solar balloon that floats with the power of hot air. All you need are some black trash bags, cellophane packing tape, scissors, and some thread. I'm using one trash bag with the bottom seam intact, then these middle two I cut off both the seam and the flaps, and then this last one I cut off the seam, but not the flaps, for the opening. Open up and overlap the trash bags together by about an inch. Then tape around each seam. Make sure you don't have any gaps or holes. Run around to fill your new balloon with air. Gather up and tie off the open end of the balloon, topping it off with air if you're up for it. The black color of the bag absorbs the sun's energy, causing the air inside to heat up. Then that air inside becomes less dense than the air around it, causing the balloon to float up, supporting its own weight. Tether your balloon and put it out in the sun, where it should heat up and start to float. This same physics powers hot air balloons you can ride in. It's the principle of buoyancy. Once the air inside heats up and expands, the balloon weighs less than the air it displaces. Now, it's very important not to let the balloon go. Not only is it a polluting environmental hazard if it gets away from you on the ground, but it's also very dangerous for airplanes. When you're ready to deflate it, be careful because the surface of the balloon will be hot. Cut a hole and start to squeeze out the air. This project is a part of my free solar class on Instructables.com, where you can learn more about harnessing the power of the sun, from backyard projects like this one to applying solar power to your microcontroller projects. I put a link in the description. It would mean so much to me if you check it out. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel to see more DIY projects about crafts, technology, and my life here in New York City.